Okay, hello Aquarians. How are you? Hope everybody's doing well. Okay, this is your weekly reading. Okay, like share, hit the notification button, be notified when I post a video. Sit back, enjoy the reading. Again, I hope you guys gain some clarity on things you need clarity on. All right. Okay, new viewers, subscribe. I'd love to have you as a subscriber. Thank you for sitting. Thank you for um stopping in, checking my channel out. Okay. So um Let's sit back, enjoy. Let's see what's going on in your energy. This is your weekly. Okay, Aquarius. Holy Spirit, show me Aquarius's energy, please. Show me Aquarius's energies. Show me Aquarius's energy. Okay, we have the Three of Cups here. Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer energy. We have justice. We have the hermit. We have judgment. We have the seven of swords. We have the nine of cups. Put that there. I oh, was telling me to put it there, but the page of cups. We have the Queen of Cups. We have the Magician. And we have the Four of Swords. Okay, so let's see what's going on here. Hmm. Okay, there's there's some somebody who wants to reunite with you. You could be wanting a separation or a divorce. Um, because this person has isolated themselves from you. Okay. For some particular reason, this person has isolated themselves from you. But now they're coming back wanting to wanting a victory and reuniting with you so you're needing to use your intuition okay use your wisdom on whether or not you're willing to reunite with this person okay so it's like a decision you're needing to make you know you're already in decision mode whether to separate from this person or not or you've already made that decision but they're coming back around, so you may get some kind of communication with this person wanting to reunite with you. Judgment is here. Again, like I said, use your wisdom in this situation because this is somebody who wants a reconciliation and, and you need to use your intuition. You may not trust this person. This person could have deceived you, could have stole from you. But at the same time, they're trying to hold on to you, okay? This person is very stubborn. Or you could see this person is very stubborn. Um, they can have a lot of other... Um, people that they deal with, that they give attention to, but they still hold on to you. Um, maybe you nurture this person in some type of way. They feel victorious with you. They feel good when they're with you, or they feel good that they just have someone with someone, um, someone like you. Maybe you're you're special in some type of way. Maybe you're doing something that none of these other cups are doing. You know that they give all this attention to, but still hold on to you at the same time. Um, and this could be where they're deceiving you at. They're dealing with a lot of other um people. And that's why you don't trust this person because you, your intuition may have already been showing you that this is what's going on or you feel like this person is going on. It's, you know, your intuition is enlightening you on a lot of things concerning this person. And maybe you just don't have con concrete proof what is going on. You're just going by your intuition. Um, Page of Cups is here. This person could want to come in and apologize to you for whatever they've done to you. Hmm. 
So yeah, there is some communication getting ready to come in. Pisces energy here. Queen of Cups. We have Scorpio energy. Yeah. Um, this person is very emotional. Okay. When it comes to you, this apologies that they're coming in with, it's going to be an emotional apology. Um, this person is the type of person that hides how they feel. They hide their emotions. They hide that you fulfill them. That is why this person holds on to you. They have a lot of emotions built up for you, but they hide it. Um, This person is manifesting a healing between you and them. All right? Aries energy is here as well. Aquarius is energy. Show me more of Aquarius is energy. Aquarius is energy. Somebody could be depressed. You may find out somebody may be sick, not well. This person coming into you may not be well. Or they're depressed without you. They could be just depressed without you. And they could be manifesting you and then it's not working. Some of you could need a lot of rest. Um, Seven of Pentacles is here. Okay, they're looking into all type of options on how to heal things with you. Five of Swords is here. This person is carrying some insecurities. They're feeling this sense of defeat, you know, on being able to get you back because how they did you, whatever they did to you, whatever you don't trust, um, they're feeling a sense of defeat. They can see you having a lot of other options. Okay, that could be why they're feeling insecure. Feeling offensive, sensitive to you because they could see you having a lot of other options, and these other options you have are very stable options that you have. They could have a lot more stability than what they have, and that could have this person insecure. Aquarius, Ten of Swords is here. Yeah, like I said, it's also because they betrayed you in the past. They could have betrayed you time and time again, backstabbed you. Ten of Cups is here. Mm. Somebody could have a family foundation. Or this is what this person um, can see their self having with you, a family foundation. You make them happy. Um, King of Swords is here. They're going to speak some type of truth to you. So maybe they've been hiding to you from you that they are, they have a family foundation. Okay. And that's one way they betrayed you or you're going to feel betrayed because they're going to speak some type of truth about that. They have a family foundation. Maybe they built the family behind your back and you didn't know this. Ten of Wands is here. Yeah. Um, this could be somebody that they're releasing. They could have went through some type of burdens with the family foundation. Somebody that they have a family foundation with and they've released that burden. They're going to come out and tell you some type of truth that they haven't told you, okay? Or either they want this with you and, and it's been burdening this, holding it in, hiding it from you. Of course, it's energy. Knight of Cups is here. Oh, they love you. So they're going to come in and speak truth too, that they love you. They're tired of holding it in. They're tired of holding it in. Pisces energy here. Death card. Yeah, this person has been doing a lot of analyzing things um, concerning the ending that you and them had between each other. They were seeing where they went wrong in the situation. And they just want to be able to have a rebirth with you, you know? So they're realizing they were in the wrong, that they were at fault with whatever caused the ending with you guys. And they just want to rebirth. They just want to be able to have a new beginning with you. Um, Three of Swords is here. This person could be at a distance from you where they no longer want to be separated from you. Um, They're at a loss without you, this person, all right? They're sad. They're feeling lonely without you. Air. Yeah. This. 
Aquarius is energy. Show me Aquarius is energy. The five of pentacles is here. Like I said, they're feeling lonely without you. They want you to bring them out the cold. They want to come out of the cold. They may feel ignored by you. Maybe you're not giving this person attention where you used to give them attention, you know? Or the distance between you guys, you know, has them feeling lonely out in the cold where they no longer want to be at a distance from you. Eight of, eight of Wands is here. So this person, maybe there was no communication. You're ignoring them. You're not giving the attention you used to give them. So they're going to be coming in very, very soon with some communication with you. All right, this person is very obsessed over you. Hey, Capricorn energy. They're very obsessed over you. Um, this person could have some type of addictions they need to heal themselves of. They could be addictions that call issues between you and this person. Um, two of wands. All right, so this is a decision that you're going to have to make. Or there's a difficult decision this person has to make concerning you. Maybe there was somebody obsessed over them. They want to let them go. All right. It was a situation that was hard for them to get out of four cups, but they're coming in with an offer. Okay. So if they're stuck somewhere in a situation and they're trying to figure out how to get it out, get out of this situation, they're choosing you over this person. Once they get out of this situation, which could be very toxic, they're coming in with an offer okay so this is what's going on of course somebody's coming in with an offer right this person could you could have had a friendship with this person somebody could be getting ready to, there could somebody could have a son and they're gonna find out it's something emotional concerning a son somebody's child Let's see. Clarify. Clarify the page of cups. Something about somebody's son is going to have an emotional state. Okay. Um, moving to better waters. Somebody's moving to better waters. It's going to have somebody emotional. So there's going to be some communication coming in where somebody's moving to moving on. Nine of Pentacles, somebody, you're going to find out somebody wants to be single. Maybe you have a child by this person. Maybe you have a son with this person. And this person is ready to move on. They want to be single. You know, they're ready, they want to, you know, venture out on their own, build on their own, nurture themselves, whoever this is. But they're going to come in with some communication. So this could be somebody you have a child with. Your 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 baby mother. It could be your baby mother. That's for somebody. Mm. Okay, Aquarius. Um, that's all I have for you. Like, share, hit the notification button to be notified when I post a video. New viewers. Subscribe. I'd love to have y'all as a subscriber. I hope I gave you guys some type of clarity on some things um, you needed to hear. All right. I'm out. I love you guys. This is your weekly.